Hey everyone, welcome to the new Soil Health Labs vlog. I'm Dr. Gabe Keeney, here with Dr. Buzz Klute. I wanted to call this vlog, Talk Nerdy To Me, since we're both nerds with PhDs. But since we're obviously gonna be talking about soils, maybe we should just keep it Talk Dirty To Me. Okay, if you want to. <laughs> well, regardless of what we decide to call it, today we're gonna dive into a fascinating case study we recently wrapped up. It's kind of rewriting what we thought we knew about soil health. We've called it Cotton, country conservation. Yeah, and we talk in our case study about some of the assumptions that we've made that we can't build soil organic matter, that if we cut back on fertilizers, we're going to lose soil fertility. If we cut back on lime, we're going to lower pHs. And of course, with all of those things, we'd lose yield. But the Price family farm in Dillon County, South Carolina, kind of challenged those ideas. Why don't you tell us a little bit about Sonny and his operation? Very briefly, they started looking at cover crops in 2013. That's when we started working with them. By 2015, they were committed. By 2017, they had everything covered in cover crops. They took away all phosphorus and potassium fertilizer, and they were applying chicken litter. And the results were kind of groundbreaking, but we'll get into all the nitty gritty details of what turned out from this eight year case study with the prices, from the soil, the yields, the money, and even to the personal aspects and how it changed the, the family and the relationship that they had with farming. Stay tuned for more of these vlogs on cotton country conservation, and you can find some links to the webpage on our website. 